Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna do a big box store tour and we're gonna start off at Lowe's and then I think we're gonna go to a Home Depot as well and we might go to a third Home Depot but I haven't decided yet but we probably will. Before we get into today's video please make sure you hit like and subscribe and check out my memberships if you haven't yet. Maybe you've been binge watching my videos and you just haven't hit that subscribe button. Welcome to the community. There's people walking past me right now. These people are like fully staring at me. Like not even trying to like be respectful. Like bro, I'm working. Whenever it's adults staring at me, I usually don't care, but that was like two full teenagers wholly staring at me. And I was like, okay. Uh, I was gonna say, welcome to the community. Now let's go get into the video. Okay, so here's the plant section. I'm just gonna say I'm a little sad. Tuesdays are supposed to be delivery days, but this doesn't exactly look best. There's some cute orchids left over from Valentine's Day, but we do have a staghorn. It's got the little paddles. Oh, these are so cute. It's like a little, it's like a fully ceramic pot. Uh, 14 98 for like a cute little ZZ plant. Oh, it's adorable. I like it. I actually like that. I appreciate you. <laughs> we also have a ton of pothos. There's always pothos at this location. These are $24.98, and I just feel like if they're gonna charge that much for pothos, it needs to be like long, but these ones are small. <laughs> We also have Peperomia polybotra. These guys are $29.99, I think. These ones have bacteria on them, so they're not the best, but you can propagate this type of Peperomia from like anything, so. <sighs> you can just cut the leaves off and have it regrow all the way in if you wanted. We do have philodendron scandens. Whoa, that's a wholly variegated leaf right there, bro. Check that out. Looks like it didn't last though. This is the next leaf. Yeah, that looks like a fluke. This is a plant you could get on a discount too. It's got mad burn on it. Any other leaves before that? It's just that one. I'm putting out a new leaf right now. I don't think one stem is worth the $30 though, especially if it's just that one leaf. Here's some of the other big staghorns. We can take a look at them. This one's pretty iconic. He's got a ton of the paddles forming. I really do like these little ZZ pots. I think that that's really cute. I would definitely get one if I wasn't on a no-buy. Other than that, it looks like we just have like some Aurelia waffle plants, Selaginella, in the works. I think that's it for this location, you guys. Sorry, this one was so sad. Okay, we are now at the Home Depot, and I'm hoping that we'll find some cute stuff for me to show you. I'm also hoping we won't find cute stuff, because then I might have to spend money. So this is the first thing you see when you walk in, and there are more plants over there. Check out these Birkins. I don't usually like Birkins, but these ones are so nice. I think if all the leaves looked like that forever, I would totally get one, but they always revert to that. Ashley? Yeah. Oh, hey. Oh, you're? Mel. Yeah. I ran into one of my friends. Hello, Mel, if you're watching. It was good to see you. Um, we also have some Sansevieria. These are really great if you want like a medium to low light plant that doesn't need too much attention and also not too much water. We have some Dracaena over here and a ton of these cute little fiddly figs. Like these leaves are really nice. These are in a really, really good shape. These are all $30 as well, by the way. Oh, they're actually $24. Here's the, the mother load. I always love walking in and looking at this. It looks so nice. So we'll start off with the tropicals. We have some mini ficus. This is actually, I think, a dwarf variety. Oh, that is literally so beautiful with the sunlight. I love this Home Depot. Then some Peperomia polybotra. These are both $29.99. Then we have some more Birkins. Looks like they got a ton of them. I was just talking to Mel. She said she found one out here that was like variegated. And then we were talking about how that actually means it's just reverting uh, to that other big one that I showed you. Like that's really pretty, but also, it's just reverting. So oh, I'm wearing my slippers today, by the way. I was like, why not? Yeah, anyways, the Birkins look super duper nice, but they always revert, so. And then up and over here, we have some neon pothos. This one actually looks very nice. Let me take it down for you. I think that this one is rather good. And a lot of you guys see these kinds of spots and you think that it's actually variegated. But neon pothos, it's actually normal for them to have those spots just about everywhere. Maybe this will be the year where I get into neon pothos. And actually right here, we have a Hoya Wayetii. Someone last time was like, hey, that's actually a Rosita. How could you pass on that? And don't worry, I would never pass on a Rosita, but this is a Wayetii and I will pass on that. And over here, we actually have some more Birkins, which would be nice, you know, if, oh my gosh, look at this leaf. This is beautiful. It's still reverting, but it looks so nice. Wow, that almost looks painted. 
How incredible. Would you look at that? More Bergens? <laughs> they have so many Bergens. I don't even know how they're gonna sell them all. We have another uh, half leaf one. But uh, yeah, sad. It will go away. This is what it will revert into. And then it and then it will just uh, stay like that. No more Birkin, just Emerald Congo. <laughs> that really looks so nice though. Well. Before we head to the final big box store, I got some plant mail. We are in the car and I got some plant mail. It's from the Planty Shop. Whoa. Ashley, I really enjoy your content. You're so silly. I made these discs and wanted to share them with you. Uh, one of them says, say uh, allo to my little friend. And then, then this one says, little friend. That is so cute. Thank you so much. And then we got plants. So this is the original reason why I wanted to come. So I will say I have no idea what to expect with this because this got here on Saturday and it shipped during the cold week. This girl Miranda was so sweet and she wanted to send me some cuttings of some of her plants and of course I said yes but I said yes before the bad week happened and then I think she forgot to ship them uh, for a while. So that's what's happened. They got here on Saturday and today's Tuesday. So it's possible that they are not alive and it is my fault because they got here four days ago. It says, Ashley, here are some cuttings for my super splashy Hoya. It was perfect timing because it was starting to grow above the top of my bed and my cats like to eat the tips. I've noticed the parts directly under my grow light are way more splashly, splashy, <laughs> splashly. Thank you so much for your advice and support this year and sorry for the backwards way of trying to make friends. Well, Miranda, I hope that they're, <gasps> Miranda, they're okay. Okay, I'm so excited. Ah, oh my god! Miranda, you did such a good job, girl, and they're rooting. Oh my god, this is so exciting because I, I have literally been dying for like a super freaking splashy Hoya. And look, you guys, look at that. Oh my god, I have to take it out and show you guys. Oh my god, I'm so happy! Oh my god, Miranda, you gave me the most beautiful cuttings. I will treasure this as if it's the most expensive Hoya. Because to me, this is literally the most beautiful Hoya I've ever seen in my life, bro. No way! Oh my god. <gasps> ah, it looks like a Wilbur Graves! You guys! You guys! Oh my god, it's so good. It has so many little roots. It like fully started to root in that prop bag, bro. So here's the first one. I'll show you guys. This is the first cutting. Oh my god, it's freaking iconic. Here is the other one. <gasps> wow, look at that. Oh my gosh, I love it. Miranda, thank you so much. I am so glad they showed up, okay? I would have lost it if they uh, if they didn't. I would have been very, very, very sad, especially that other cutting that I just put down. But this one's even better. Wow, I love it. Oh, it's so beautiful. I literally can't believe that that's real. I love plants. <gasps> How is that real? Okay. Wow, I literally can't. Thank you so much, Miranda. This literally made my week. I wanted to buy that uh, pupa K like so bad, and I didn't because I'm responsible, but I am so glad that I waited for yours because you didn't send me any photos of the ones you were gonna send me because I said to surprise me. Ah, I love it so much. Okay, we're at the next Home Depot and it's actually sundown right now, it's so pretty. So I am excited because they have a lot more here than at the other locations. For example, I'm counting one, two, three, four, five. Uh, Hoya Weiriai, and it looks like we also have like Hoya Lacunosa. This is always the good Home Depot, but I live so far away from this location now, I literally never come. You guys are $17.98, which is a really good price if you want a Lacunosa in Boise. They are more expensive at North End, and they're also smaller at North End, but also Home Depot plants can be iffy. We have quite a few of these Lacunosas. Then we have some Swedish ivies, some big petonias, a ton of Sansevieria, more Lacunosa actually, some uh, variegated Marantas, 
some variegated chaflaras. Over here we have a ton of the mini fiddle leaf figs, which are nice. On the right side, we have some more lacunosa again, some ferns, and uh, some friendship plants right there. There was a pretty big ficus I saw. These ones are $88. This one's especially nice. Yeah, this is one that I would buy if I was like looking for like a cute little fiddle leaf fig. However, I have Gloria, so I don't need one. Again, we have a ton of Birkins. Costa Farms really just said, let's send all of our Birkins to Boise. The other one at the other place is actually really nice. It was so hard to not buy that, but your girl's on a no buy, so it's not allowed. Again, this is what they always revert to. That. We have some little four inch plants and they look really, really nice. Some little Trandoscantia and some Fetonia, some different types of ivy. Yeah, pretty much just all the same. Hi, we have some Maranta Luconura red. These ones don't look too bad. These are $12.98. We have some really nice succulents at this location. That one and that one are incredible. Look at that. We have some of these smaller ones, which are also nice. This one is especially wonderful. Down here is where they hide the Haworthia, it looks like. Don't see anything too super interesting. Then over here we have a couple of these new begonias that Costa's been sending out. These are not better than begonia maculata. So in my opinion, they shouldn't send these out. <laughs> Some more Birkins, just literally everywhere. And I think that that's actually it. Not too much, but definitely more of a variety. We do have this incredible orchid. That looks like a sapelia flower. Wow. One of these days, I will just find an irrigated orchid. This one's like butter. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching this video. Please make sure you hit like, subscribe, and tweet me at plantmeashley. Follow me on Instagram at plantmeashley. I also have some fun stuff going on. My memberships, so come check out the memberships. It's super fun. And we have merch. Special thank yous to Crazy Chick Vintage, Botanicas, and the Planted Carly Flower for supporting this channel. But other than that, thank you guys so much for watching. I am going to be buying some Captain Jack's pesticide because I am out and that is a requirement. Uh, but other than that, I stuck to my no buy today and I'm very proud of that. So yeah, I will be making a no buy video. It's gonna come out, I think on March 23rd, uh, two days after my no buy has been over. So it gives me time to like get through all the footage because I'm gonna try to film uh, every other day for a month about the no buy, so. All right, well, I'll see you guys in the next houseplant section. Goodbye.